Good evening, uh, ladies and gentlemen. This is Whoopi speaking, and we are going for the part three of this uh, PMH motor, which is, as you can see, running this evening already. And as a lot of people ask me, how many amps is the draw? I show you directly here at eight volt, about thirty nine milliamps. In this new version, because I will show you why after. Okay, what you can see now that the total ramp led is full working now at full speed because I put this capacitor away from the circuits and I have put here a short key diode. I am not sure it is very important because all diodes works. Okay. And uh, now the problem is that we will go to a. I will shoot the power off now and we show you some tests I made today. Today I trust, I tested this other PMH. This is only one coil and two probes. So there is almost a uh, PMH with only one coil. This is another one here, all comes from the motor of micro and oven. And this is the center here, so I could use it as a, perhaps somebody can see. Imagine now the tick 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 plate. Alright. All these coils has much more copper, so they are much more resistance and much more inductance than this one. But at each test, I couldn't get all this light lighting. On the scope, the spike was very strong, almost minus 200 volts and more, but impossible to light all this light together, as this can do. I don't know why. Probably because this is much less inductance and resistance as you can see on the part one of this video and uh, the power is much better okay now a uh, last test i will make this next day i will put back my capacitor on the board and i have put here in the middle and you can see a magnet in the center here and I will try to get out the power of the capacitor with this read. So you have. Ah, I forgot to say you that I change the poles on the disc magnet. All are now south. So from each passage in front of the oval switch, you have the power. And as you can see, it is much, much better. Okay, so I will test and get out six times the negative back spike and on each turn I will get it on this read to go somewhere useful. But the question is, where is useful? And the idea would be, would it be possible to get out directly from these circuits back here to these circuits? not going through a capacitor. I am not sure, but I will test it. Okay, I think so the homework for tonight are made and perhaps it will be uh, part four. All right, thank you very much. Good night.